to all my subscribers, um, Green Bar Digitals here, formerly known as Green Bar Digitals, actually, yeah, but it's Alien Text now, yeah. Okay, um, so today I'll be teaching you guys on how um, you can avoid this error um, on your Google Ads account. I know many of you notice this error. Um, anytime you sign up on your Google Ads account, it says your account is suspended for an unpaid balance. Yes. Yes, that's the issue. Um, today I'm gonna show you how we can stop that error. You understand? How we can create an account and we can stop the error. Yeah, um, actually I have an account on that error. I'll just show you. I'll just show you some proof on how you can stop the error. Yeah. Okay. Um, first of all, if you are just new to Google, you can go to your Chrome actually. Um, then you go to ads.google.com. You just say it ads.google.com. You can see it right here. Um, so you click on ads.google.com, it will automatically redirect you for a sign up. You understand when you sign up on your Google Ads, um, when you sign up, then you will. I'm sure you will know how the next step to do because um, they will ask for your website information, ask you to write a headline for your ad, you understand? Then you add your accounts, your card account, you understand? Either your bank account, your paper, or your credit card um, to Google Ads so they can easily charge you. Um, so after you've done all this, and they restricted it, they suspended their account for unpaid balance. Um, these are the issues which causes that either you don't have up to the money they want to charge on your account, that's $50, either you don't have up to $50 on your bank account, or either your domain or your account or your card has been blacklisted, you understand? But we can easily um, bypass this issue. It's not that hard, we can fix it. Okay, um, before you can fix this, um, you have to go on your Google Ads. This is how we to say it to say your ad account has been suspended. You can see it here. Yeah, um, then you will hit the contact us. Actually, you can't use um, you can't use your phone to do this. Um, you have to use your laptop or a computer to do this because when you try using your phone, it won't give you a full display like this, you understand? Um, so when you hit the contact us, um, you see what comes up here. Um, why is my ad account suspended due to paid balance? Okay, um, before you can, let me reload the page. Um, before you can do this, I'm um, sorry, I never updated you. Before you can do this, Firstly, you have to pay. You have to pay at least ten dollar or twenty dollar on your Google Ads account. Um, then you hit the contact us. Okay, let me show you. When I made this account, um, I don't have any. I had no payments on my bank account. But um, right now I made the payment of two hundred. I made the payment of two hundred dollars. So let me show you how we can. Um, Easily submit the information to Google Ads so they can reopen our account. Okay, um, you contact us, you hit the contact us tab, then it says, Why is my account suspended due to an unpaid balance? Yeah, um, so you can see what it says here. Um, you have an unpaid balance in your account. Most times, this unpaid balance is an issue, you understand, like it's. A problem from Google so they say to resolve the suspension first make a payment then submit an appeal using the form link above so um, you hit this submit an appeal yes you hit this submit an appeal okay see so what next your Google has account was suspended for violating our advertising policies okay you have to hit the advertising policies to read more in details why your account was suspended okay as a result your account your ads are not running okay google ads enables businesses to promote a wide variety of products services application and websites we want a healthy digital advertising ecosystem okay you can see that yes so um what we're gonna do now um, is scroll 
the same scrub. You scroll, you scroll, you scroll, you scroll. Okay, it says your contact name. This is the name on your Gmail. It says I'm your contact email. This is the email attached. It says your email says that's where they can contact you. It says your Google Ads select the Google Ads ID. This is your Google Ads ID. This here. That's your Google Ads ID. I did not copy it, finished, but this is your Google Ads ID. Okay, you key it in here. You key it in here. Yes. The Google Ads ID this Okay, it asks for your website. Okay, you can easily add it. You can easily add. It adds for some sample keywords from your campaigns. So if you've run a campaign and it's got suspended, you can add one of the sample keywords you used. Okay, um, so it asks for your billing address. Yeah, you can just add a billing address used on your account. Yes, that's how it goes. Okay, here's a billing country. Um, you add your country. Yes, you add your country. Add the country. Yeah. You add the country. Okay. Okay, you can see it. Do you have your single or multiple Google Ads account? If you are running a multiple Google Ads account, then you can click the MCC. Um, but I'm running a single Google Ads account, yes. So are you advertising your own business? Yes, no. If you're doing an affiliate, you can click here. Yes. I'm an affiliate actually, but you can hit any of them. Okay. Who pays for the Google Ads account? You explain, you explain briefly here. Who pays for the Google Ads account? Then um, you select the payment option the way you paid, either credit or debit card invoicing. Direct bank transfer, direct debit, Google um, grants. Yes. Okay. Then input the last day of your payments. Yes. Then what country does your business have? USA, UK, anyone? You add it there. Then it asks for. It asks for. A, brief description of your business and um, we can just highlight this text and maybe um, edit what you do what your website does you understand that's how it goes on um, okay so um, information regarding client agency you can skip this for more details you can provide the domain ownership explain to them who owns the domain you understand if this is your account okay in case we get disconnected how can we contact you either phone or email call me or email i prefer the email option yeah because most times the call option i don't think it goes okay um so you can easily put your phone number here uh, please inform the preferred time we can reach you input your phone number and your time there you give a full detailed explanation of the issue you're experiencing yeah you give a full this explanation of the, the um, if possible you can screenshot what you're seeing on your dashboard and send to google here then you submit or before then you admit the capture and you submit after you've submitted google will take um one day to accept and uh, review your requests before they approve your account you understand so that's not a big issue um it's not a big issue actually god will approve your account if they see your account is still if your account is working fine without any of their policies being damaged because most times google uses bots to watch on most of our activities you understand so most times it might be an error from the bot which needs a manual verification and when your verification was successful then god will approve okay um so after everything is done
you give it a day then you go back to your email or come back here then refresh then maybe google might have reactivate your account yeah and you're good to go okay so um actually thanks for watching thanks for watching on my website green bar digitals here don't forget to hit a subscribe to the website and no sorry don't forget to hit a subscribe to my youtube here green bar digitals don't forget to hit a subscribe we are going higher we're going higher okay thanks ciao